It was time to head for the laboratory. Two scientists, Cambridge University, three lovely ladies. This is where we broach the subject, sex. It was time to find out how chimps and humans compare genetically. A biological anthropologist at Cambridge, Leslie Knapp, had asked for a sample of DNA from me, from my human mate Ed, and from an old friend of mine, Cody. We were to take part in a groundbreaking experiment. These are six females, mm -hmm. and you and Ed and the chimp, and you can see that no one is exactly the same. Well, this lady here appears to be mostly chimp. <laughs> Leslie's lab had analyzed just a short sequence of the chimp's genetic code, less than one gene, and then compared it with mine and with my mate Ed's. The genes she looks at control the smell of our body odor. So you look down here and you see that Ed and the chimp are identical. Let's just exactly, there's no differences there There's at no all difference in, in that length of sequence. But if we compare you and Ed, uh -huh. what we find is that there are six differences. Six between me six. and Ed, and none between Ed and the chimp. And none between Ed and the chimp. So according to science, my friend Ed's genes suggest that he might smell like a chimp. Chimpanzees and humans can sometimes be more similar to one another than they are to other members of the same species. 